This is a video to show you how to make a watermark for including on your finale music notation scores when you want to print out a copy that has a draft watermark on it. So I'm using a free program here called Paint.net. It's kind of a scaled down version of Adobe's Photoshop. And the default image that you get here is an 800 by 600 rectangle. That works just fine. The first thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to select all by doing control A and I'm going to delete the white background so I've got transparency happening right here. The next thing I'm going to do is come down here to the colors. I'm going to select this light gray color which you see on most watermarks and then I'm going to go in here to the uh, more controls and I'm going to turn the transparency up to about two-thirds around there. Okay. Now I'm going to use my text tool and uh, I've already selected impact as the font and 108 points um, for the size and I'm going to do capital D R A F T like that I'm going to center that a little bit and now I'm going to go up here to layers and I'm going to rotate that so that it is going diagonally across the page so I drag that up here like this and now it's going diagonal Okay, it's going to finish that for me. I'm going to draw a box around that and I'm going to make it bigger by clicking over here. Move selected pixels. I'm going to grab this in the corner. I'm going to drag and make it bigger. Okay, then I'm going to reposition it kind of in the middle. All right, so that is my watermark. Now I'm going to go up here to File. I'm going to select Save As and then I am going to save as type TIFF, T-I-F-F, -F. that's a scanned file from like a scanner and I'm going to save it there. I've actually already done that. Now I'm going to switch over here to Finale and show you one of concert band scores. This is a piece I wrote a while back called Eternal Majesty. I'm going to go up here. This is Finale 2012 by the way. 2014 is out but uh, I imagine it's very similar in here. I'm going to go to the Tools menu, Advanced Tools, and select graphics. Okay, that's going to give me this graphics menu. I'm going to place graphics. All right, now here I have to go into my files and find that TIFF file, which is down here. I called it draft watermark landscape. Okay, there we go. So now I have a cor I got the upper corner where I'm going to place this. I'm going to click there. Watermark. Okay, now you can uh, drag this and position it where you want it to be and that makes a really nice looking watermark in the middle of the page. I now want that to appear on all of my pages so I'm going to go to attributes. I'm going to say all pages and give it a second and voila I now have draft printed on every page of my score all the way through to the end. You can then print this out, convert it to a PDF, and uh, have a draft stamped on there. You of course can make the watermark anything that you want, so if you have a logo for your for your publishing or anything else like that that you use, you can very easily uh, make that watermark look like whatever you want. You can make it darker or lighter, however you see fit. All right. hope that this video has been helpful to you to create a quick watermark on your music scores using Finale 2012.